Welcome to day 18 in the advent of a leader as a good regulator that must be a model of the complex adaptive system that they lead and regulate. We're now diving into the very last face of our model. And it is the last of the piecewise views. And here we dive into the issue of thoroughness. Because as we uncovered this model yesterday and looked at the hierarchy between the strategy, the uh, capability and execution layers uh, of an organisation, the devil is in the detail because each of these mutually constrains the other in the work that gets done. So are we being sufficiently thorough to understand that detail? So let's dive in and say, if we're understanding the relationships between the major elements of structure, do we understand the systemics? Are we being sufficiently thorough in our analysis? Or are we diving to point solutions that ultimately lead us to what could be compiled as thoughtless actions? because we haven't looked at the consequences of what these point solutions do. It's like the sugar candy, the hit, great hit for today, but in the long term, the lack of thoroughness really bites. So thoroughness for systemic outcomes is absolutely crucial. We wouldn't go to the doctor and expect anything less, so we shouldn't be modeling anything less as leaders, as regulators. Which leaves us with the question today then, of have we accepted a level of analysis below the complexity of the system that we're leading and regulating? Hmm? Have we been sufficiently thorough? Now, that's hard. But life wasn't meant to be easy, said one prime minister. And it's true for every leader. Have we been sufficiently thorough? How would you answer this question?